that the Bombers do slow down. There's Mick Malthouse, and he had plenty to say at the three-quarter time huddle, and it was a good old-fashioned football huddle as well. He got the players, he sat them down, and away Mick went. 19 points the margin. Tony Jones was within earshot, we believe. Uh, TJ, what was Mick Malthouse on about at three-quarter time? Well, I, I tell you what, it was the most savage spray you would ever want to see, and it was unrelenting. He just went one by one, pointing out several... Uh, well, he just said at one stage there was not one of them who actually followed any team instructions there. At one stage there, we might see it here, where he actually bends down, points straight into the face of Scotty Burns, and just went bang and launched into him. And after he'd finished with him for about 30 seconds, he turned on to another, and uh, it was just unrelenting there. Even the coaching staff standing around and just looking at each other, shaking their head. No one game to actually make eye contact with him. It was, in every sense of the word, vicious. Good on you, Tar. Great stuff. And I guess we've all been on the receiving end, Dan. And we've sent TJ into the Collingwood rooms to interview Mick after the game. <laughs> hey, uh, look, 19 points down. He would be imploring them to get back on track. They did look sluggish in that second quarter, a uh, third quarter after a spirited comeback.